After my old camp was raided by bandits and taken over by the infected, I was lucky enough to be found by an old friend named James and the man who brought us together, York. Together, we three traveled until we came across a group of strangers who quickly became friends. That's how I met Michael. And together, we've agreed that if necessary, we'll run. I think you just start fishing. And you want to check the bait every once in a while? Oh, wow. Oh, I've never actually been fishing in my life. You check the bait until you feel like you have something there. Wow. <laughs> Here, give it. Oh, you kind of dropped your axe. Okay. It is, uh, <laughs> whoops. Okay, so how do you do it? You just find a spot in the water and then you cap the pole. Uh, okay. Oh, hi Rose. Morning, how to fish? Fish. Uh, yeah. There it is. Oh, there you go. Oh, wow. This is, this is pretty awesome. I gotta admit, it's pretty cool. How do you take a Well, Well, you just look at the pole and check the... Hey, whoops. That's how you do it. Okay. There we go. No, no, no. Damn it. This is the harder it looks, sir. Oh, yeah. Not an easy task. I did catch a fish for me and Rose, though. Hopefully she enjoyed it. Huh? I'm betting you she did. Yeah. She, she does enjoy more things, so... <laughs> it's not that fun to watch a lot. Babs found oh, no. some metal wire for you, if you want it. She gave it to me to give to you. Oh. So far, no luck on it. Oh, thank you very much, sweetheart. Oh, but... Bunch of wire. Thank you. Now we can make some rabbit traps and I'll teach you where to set Okay, uh, so far Michael, no luck in it. Yeah. I guess it takes time to get better at huh? Yeah, yeah, it does. Did we do that? I didn't know I couldn't move. <laughs> Yep, and now you just look at the pole, and check it, and just keep checking it. You'll eventually sense some movement, and then you'll get a bite eventually. It takes time. You know how fishing is. It takes patience. Yeah. I understand, sir. You're, you're a very good teacher, Mike. Am I a good teacher? Eat some pumpkin with me? I need you to eat two pieces. I had someone near the bait, but sure. it's gone now. Alright, so what you do, Rose, is you get the stick. At the end, and then you just attach them to the metal wire. Create a snare trap in the middle wire. And you do it with both wire and stick. Take one stick, take one wire, and then boom. The stick is no longer needed. And this is what you get. Here you go, Rose. You can hold it. And we should go set it over here. Back on. Oh, you're right.
Alright, we're gonna put the we're gonna put the first one right here. That's like a good spot, right? Right? Alright, and let's go back over here a little first. Further. You want to put one right here? We'll remember this stump. Did I do it right? You did it perfectly. That's awesome. Good job. Oh, and thank you. Oh, well, that's an interesting pose right there, my dear. There you go. Go. Now we go back over to the water and wait at least a couple minutes and then we come back and check our traps, okay? Okay. Yeah. I'm surprised you're still awake. I still have a little bit longer. Good, good. I enjoy my time with you, so don't worry. I'm going to try to push you off too. Thank you. Oh, sure. well, we, should, we should go and check our tracks. Let me help you up. Oh, there. there we go. I guess I had to get on my knees to do it. I know, I know. I'm Prince Charming, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm your Prince Charming, though, so don't you forget that, Missy. I couldn't. I believe this trap is gone. I believe the rabbit took it away. We should go check this other one. What? Oh, look at We got one. Well, this was yours. Good spot. You picked it. Oh, we got some good rabbit. Oh, we don't need those. Anymore. Well, at least it sure stays around, right? Hopefully we went to the right tree. I think that was the right tree, wasn't it? I thought it was. Alright, we can, we can turn that off now. We're going to go over by the garden area. I showed you that rock. places over there, yeah. We got two nice pieces of meat though. We'll eat like royalty tonight. Oh, oh yeah.
Where was I caught on? Oh, there's a rock right Careful not to trip. Right there. Right? I almost... Did. You want to place the trap again? Because you seem to be my lucky little rabbit, so... This is always a good Behind it or in front of it? No, it doesn't matter. Where, where do you want to sit? Now where would you like to sit? Right. Is this good? Yeah, yeah this is great. Look at that, we can even get even closer, so that's cool. Great. Did you enjoy your day? Did you enjoy staring at me? Don't be shy, sweetheart. You can stare all you want. I'll stare at you. I like looking into your eyes. They're very beautiful. What's on your mind, sweetheart? I'm just getting a little nervous. I mean, I've heard a car nearby. I've heard gunshots. And then now I saw a guy down in the town. I'm just worried that we're not going to be safe here much longer. And that we're going to have to run. Alright. Well, if that time ever comes, are you going to be ready? That's Food good. And water That's all I needed all to hear. Good stuff, girly. Good. <laughs> so what do you want to do tomorrow? Maybe come back into the town. Oh, you want to go to the town? Tomorrow? Camp a little. Do that? Yeah. Yeah. I agree. I'm sorry if you feel like you have to stay here all cooped up with me. Oh no, I like this. If I wanted to, I'd just grab you by the hand and we'd, we'd leave right now. Go wherever you want. But, no. I'm here because you're here. Why? 
Don't feel like you're a burden. You're not. If anything, you're my burden. I'm happy to have you. You sure you're always gonna think that, though? I'm, I'm 100% sure I always think that, yeah. I don't know if you want me to go. You, you want me to go? Yes, no, yes. No, no. Please don't. You want me to stay? Don't yeah. even, don't even joke about leaving, please. No, oh, no, no. What else is troubling you, Rose? Are you sure you're still okay with Sasha and York? I mean, like, just being around them? I mean, it wasn't that long ago that everything happened with y'all. Yeah, I'm fine with it. I got you. You're incredible. And I'm not strong or a leader like Sasha is. I'm nothing like her. Oh, you're strong. We just haven't... I'm not your full potential yet. Slowly. We're working on it. No, I have, I've had you throw two grenades already. And shoot an AK. What else is bothering you, Rose? It's, it's nothing. I promise. I mean, you think it's nothing. You can tell me anything. conversation will go, so why bother having it? I see. I see. Don't worry, sweetheart. Don't worry. Everything's gonna work itself out, you know, it eventually it does.
Let's have a little talk to James. He has, yeah, I have his blessing, so I don't know. Um, it, was, it was a little awkward, because now he's, I feel like he's younger than me. I think he is younger than me. And I had to get permission. He's like, he feels like to you that like you are a sister. He's never had brothers or sisters. Yeah, we've known each other for a very long time. I, I, I told York about us. Yeah? Did you? How hard did he take it? I think he already knew. It seemed like Sasha told him. I guess she overheard us the other day at the lake. And Sasha overheard us, yeah. 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 With Edward Ray. Right? Does it bother you? That everyone's starting to know? I like it better that way. I like it better that way too. Everyone knows who I belong to. Does that make you feel better? Knowing that I belong to you? I feel better knowing that I belong to you as well. So. But I, you don't have to do all this nice stuff for me. I don't really deserve it. Is this you trying to push me away? No, no, it's not that. It's just. I'm not the best person sometimes. I, I yell and I've I've made a lot of mistakes. I've made a lot of mistakes, sweetheart. I'm 25 years old. I've, I've made a lot of mistakes. I'm pretty sure I yell too once in a while. I might not yell here, but yeah, I get mad. Because you're human. If you didn't do any of that shit, I think you'd be an alien or something. You know? But it makes you human. It's who you are. Some mistakes are bigger than others. That's true. But you're not a mistake. It, it's a mistake that I'm alive and my friends aren't. Maybe you're a little stronger than you thought you were, huh? nothing to do with strength. It's stupid, dumb luck and running and... <sighs> Look at me, bro. You're not stupid. Well, you are pretty lucky because you did catch a fucking rabbit. So. But. Sweetheart, you're more than you actually think you are. Or I would never have asked you to be mine. I see something in you that I don't see in nobody else. That's a damn big heart. You're so caring and loving. You, you probably wouldn't have asked me to be yours if you knew everything, though. 
Well, I want to know everything. I'm, you want to be the judge of that? Let's see if I stay or not, shall we? Let's hear it, Rose. You won't look at me the same way. York doesn't. I, I, I won't tell James. He, he would probably kill me. But I, I'm not York. I'm not James. I'm Michael. Talk to me, sweetie. Tell me. And if it's that bad, then it's that bad. I can change my opinion on you. you exactly what happened to mine and James's previous camp? No one has told me anything. Not even James. Well, we came in from the southwest and since then I've learned that that's uh, one of those red zones. And we didn't know that, we just knew that they were safe areas. And it was dark, and some bandits came, and they hit our camp pretty hard, but all the shots, they brought a lot of infected, and I saw a lot of people die, but right before the bandits came, right before the bandits came, I had decided that I wanted to learn how to shoot a gun, because no one would teach me. So I grabbed a pistol out of one of the counselor's tents, I went to the edge of the camp, and I started shooting at some cans, and that's what brought the bandits, and that's why everyone died. It's all my fault. You couldn't have known that what was going to happen. I could have been smarter, I could yeah. have been better, I could have stayed and tried to help, but I ran, and because I ran... You'd be dead if you would have stayed. So, you're here for a reason, sweetheart. I deserve to be dead. No, no, no. You deserve so much more. You're so young still. There's so much ahead. You think I'm gonna run from you, Tom, and all that? Sweetheart, I told you about with my sister, right? And you're still here. I watched my little sister die, being swarmed by at least 30 plus zombies, and I had to run. She was only 13 years old, but as soon as she got bit, it was over. Favor. I tried so damn hard and I couldn't. Do it. I watched my family get murdered in front of me. My mom, my dad. Because the people were hungry. And said no. How, how did you survive? I ran away. I 
on the first plane out. Ended up here in Russia. Not nearly as bad as it was in America. The infection in America took, took over quite quickly and left a lot worse. James is pretty convinced that it's just here. I told him he was wrong. I told him that back home was... Yeah, he too. asked about my story. He, he didn't take it very well when I told him how America got hit pretty hard. See, if anything, you should be running from me. Why? Because I can't save my little sister. I'd probably still be here if I'd fucking be able to kill all those fucking there were so many zombies. So many zombies. I have nightmares all the time about it. Always running through my head. Trying to replay the same thing over and over again. Always the same outcome. about that night too. Well, I'm not going anywhere. I'm not leaving you. If anything, I'm going to grab your hand and leave with you. You got me? You sure? I'm 100% sure, sweetheart. And I won't let go of that hand until I know we're safe. Do you still see me the same way? Yeah. She is my lovely rose. If anything, I think you see me differently. Still my mind. What do you think? What do you think? You're not a coward, alright? You're not a coward. That's what you think you are. You're not. You're not weak, by no means, no. That's fine. We have each other. That's all that matters now, right? We can get through this together. We got what it takes. We can both run. And I'm going to do whatever I can to protect you. I'll die for you, sweetheart. And I'll kill for you. Just to keep us safe. Okay? Okay, right? It'll be okay as long as I keep breathing and my heart still keeps beating. So. Means you need to be super careful when you go out on red zone runs. I, I don't know what I would do if I woke up and they told me that something happened to you. Yeah, well...
Well, um, if that were to happen, which I doubt will happen, then I want you to stay strong. I want you to die. I want you to kill yourself. I want you to find Sasha or Edward. to get you and I'll always love you, Rose. Okay? Because I'll always be right there inside there, alright? No matter what, I'll always be in there. Got me? Other, aren't we? I think we are very good for each other. I couldn't agree more. Thank you for not looking at me differently. You're the only person besides York that I've told. Well, I'm definitely not your ex. I'm not going to take that any other way. I understand what you had to do. Hell, I would have been the same person probably shooting my gun out, trying to learn how to shoot. You know? And now you got me. I'm teaching you. Uh, I'm sorry that I've yelled at you or gotten you yelled at for the same thing. I know it's really hypocritical of me. Oh no, no. I understand why you don't like it now. Because anyone could actually hear him. So when we're away from camp, we can shoot all we want. But when we're close like this, no more. Except for the bow and arrow, we can shoot that wherever the hell we want to. I'm pretty sure Rick Shire is going to forget you. It might take a little minute from him, but I don't understand why he got so upset with you. He didn't get upset about that. He didn't even seem to care about that when I talked to him today. I, I, I yelled at him because he told me I was like a daughter to him. and I'm not his daughter. I, I thought we were... You know, I mean, we're not equals. He, he was the leader of our little group, but I thought he would at least see me as an adult. I mean, how would you feel if Sasha oh said God. that you're like a son to her? I'd laugh. I could. I could. I could really mad. You're my baby, so. You're not no child at all. You're a grown woman. I can see that clearly. Shall we go check our trap and then head back to camp? Come on up. There's my beautiful girl. 